In 1987, Michael Jackson hired the principal dancers for the World Bad Tour. Being hired for a position like this was every dancer's dream come true. The Bad Tour was 132 concerts across 15 countries and an audience of 4.4 million screaming fans. Being a dancer for Michael Jackson was as close as anyone could get to being the king of pop themselves. But one dancer who hired for the tour became more than just a backup dancer. Lavelle Smith Jr. not only went on to tour with Michael for the Dangerous and History tours, he also earned Michael's admiration as a dance choreographer. Lavelle Smith Jr. would go on to choreograph a few of Michael's live routines, such as the frenetic jam performance that opened the Dangerous tour and the live performance of Dangerous as seen on the MTV Awards in 1995. But perhaps his greatest work was the mind-blowing dances of the short film Ghosts. Michael and Lavelle literally spent years together, at each other's side, and a friendship formed out of mutual respect and admiration. And importantly, Lavelle saw Michael with children. Lavelle even saw him with his now accusers Wade Robson and James Safechuck. Lavelle was there in 1987 when Wade met Michael on stage. He got to know James Safechuck, who even joined them on the Bad Tour as a dancer. He witnessed firsthand Michael interact with children and these two men now looking for a billion dollar payday. It is for that reason that what Lavelle has to say is so important because he knows all parties involved. So just over a week ago, a new documentary was released called The Man Behind the Dance. In it, we get to hear firsthand Lavelle's recollections of Michael, the man he worked with for 23 years. But very importantly, we get to hear what he has to say about these two accusers, two men he knew personally. Let's listen to what Lavelle has to say on the Leaving Neverland Billion Dollar Lie. He really wants the truth, my truth. You're gonna bleep a lot of this. Why? Why? He gave you everything. And, um, it's heartless to do that to a man that can't defend himself. So, why? I hate to say why I think they're doing it, but I'm gonna say it money, dollar signs. These people, they are bankrupt. They are corrupted. They will sell their souls to the devil. Let's be honest. If Michael Jackson were alive, this would not be happening. Plain and simple. And I've done all my research, and I know it didn't happen. And you guys are liars. And um, there's a special place in hell for you. Thank you, Lavelle, for your powerful rebuttal. Michael would be proud of you for having defended his name. To all of Michael's fans, I invite you to watch the documentary, The Man Behind the Dance. The link is in the description below. Please watch and share. Let the world hear about Michael from one of the people who knew him better than anyone else. Thank you, Lavelle, for sharing your powerful story.